Ephesians 1 and 7. Ephesians 1 and 7. Amen. I just want to thank God for each and every one here in the sanctuary. Praise God. I want to thank each and every one of you all for being here tonight. For God have a word for his people. Amen. And those of you all right now that may be listening over the airways, I want you to call somebody. Let them know that applying the word ministry is on the air. And I let them know that God got a word for them tonight. Amen. Praise God. Now, those of you all that's listening on our way, tell somebody if they're not in the listening audience or the listening uh, area, that they can go to our website at www.applyingtheword-ga.org. They can go to the website and then go to our media page. And once they get to the media page, then they can select the program which they so desire at this time, praise God. You know, I want to also, while they're at the uh, website, they can uh, go and bless the ministry. They can go and become a partner or simply just be, let somebody know that you appreciate what we're doing here, what we're doing over the airways, trying to bless the children of God with the word of God to empower them. Amen. Praise God. And we also have a prayer page where you can go to the prayer page and let us know in prayer what you need God to do. The word of God said when there's two or three touching and agreeing, God is in the midst. We want to be in agreement with you that God may answer prayer. We're here to do that. Amen. Praise God. And those of you all that, that's not computer literate, Hey, listen, listen, listen. You can write us at P.O. Box 1075, LaGrange, Georgia, 30241. we be loving to hear from you. Amen. Praise God. Now, we had told you that, that turn to Ephesians 1 and 7. If you have it, just acknowledge by saying amen. Amen, amen again. Amen. Praise God. And it reads, in whom we have redemption through his blood for forgiveness of sin, according to the riches of his grace. Now, uh, glory to God. I'm going to take my topic this evening, breaking the chains. I said breaking the chains. Uh, you, you, you're talking about breaking chains. I said breaking the chain because there's a lot of people the devil got chained down. He got you chained down physically through alcoholism, through drug addiction. He, he just got you chained down. And he got some of you chained down financially. Got you broke, busted, and disgusted. He got some of you chained down in your, in your bodies. Through sickness, all kind of ailments and pain. He got you chained, but I'm here to tell you tonight, break the chain. Break the chain. Because everything I name, you can be delivered. Now, now, I, I want to say break the chain, and we want to use a, a, a symbolism of slavery. I need to have a slave chain up. Now, now I, I was just reading, and, and, and as I was studying my lesson, and just, just hear me, because again, I'm coming from Ephesians. Now, Ephesians, that letter that Paul wrote is a letter of fullness. Can I get a witness? It's a letter of fullness. You see, a lot of times, uh, glory to God, when it says break the chain, you see, sometimes you got slaves think they're free because, you know, you had uh, different types of slaves, amen? You had some of the slaves that worked in the field and some of them worked in the house. Can I get a witness? So I'm here to tell you them, just because the chains may not be on you, you still might be a slave because guess what? Your mind may not be free. But 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 I just want to point out to you a little bit of background on what I was reading uh, pertaining to slavery. It said, we found our visit to a church cathedral. It was in Stone Town, Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe. And and it, 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 it deeply moved me, for it was sitting on a site that was once a former or the former largest slave market in East Africa. 
So, so, so you got to understand, it was a lot of slavery going on here. But I'm here to tell you, it was a lot of slavery going on right around you. Yeah. Just because they ain't got chains on that don't mean they ain't, that they're not a slave. Yeah. Every time you hear somebody talking about how poor they are, they're a slave. Yeah. Every time you hear them talking about how sick they are, they're a slave. Yeah. Every time you hear them talking about they need to get a fix, they need to get, oh, go to, <laughs> they, they, they're a slave. But I'm here, break them chains. Because we got to know that through his blood. Yeah. It said through his blood, yeah. we forgive him. Yeah. And once we forgive him, we are no longer slave, but now we're free. Yeah. Now, 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 they said this was, the big, this was the biggest slave market in East Africa. The designers of this, of this cathedral, they, they wanted to show through the physical symbol how the gospel had broke the chains of slavery yeah. and it no longer existed. Yeah. Can I get a witness? You see, when they built the, the when they built the cathedral, they actually started preaching and teaching Jesus Christ. Yeah. Now, if you got to understand, Christ is a deliverer. Yeah. Christ is one that sets you free. Yeah. Regardless of what type of what type of slavery you're under, God can set you free through Jesus Christ. Yeah. Now, now, now they, they looked at that, that, that symbolism because guess what? They was also hearing a word. Glory to God. They were hearing a word letting them know. On this location, this place is no longer going to be doing these evil deeds. Amen. These horrible situations. But God yes. is embracing grace. Yes. Now, we got to understand grace, grace, yes. grace. You see, through the blood of Jesus, that was grace. Yes. Jesus Christ died that you may have grace. You can't, you can't work for it. Yes. You can't earn it. But he died that you might have it. Yeah. You see, Jesus Christ died on, on Calvary over 2,000 years ago. Yeah. But when he died 2,000 years ago, you, you, might have, you might have been born 20 years ago, 30 years ago, 40 years ago. But guess what? He still died for you. Yeah. Because that blood, yeah. that blood is everlasting. Yeah. That blood, yeah. that oh, can I get a witness in there? Yeah. I need you to understand and see that anything that's tying you down, Anything that, that's stopping you from getting close to, to Jesus, hey, it's a chain. It's a chain. Breaking the chain. You got to break that chain. I know about chains. I haven't been chained before. I haven't been chained up to things I felt I, I just had to have. Glory to God. I just had to have it. But I'm here to tell you, it was a chain. Glory to God. For, oh, glo listen, chains, chains. But they can be broken. Amen. You see, but now through breaking the chains, you got to understand, you got to know you forgave, you forgiven. You got to know the God I forgave you for. You see, when you know, when you know God has forgiven you, you then try to crucify that old nature. Yeah. Oh, glory to God. You, you got to realize I'm free. Yeah. If you still think, you know, if, if, if you're saying you're free, but you're still acting like a oh, can I get a witness in there? Right. Right. Now, 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 now look here. The word forgiveness literally means to send off or away. Yeah. Uh, like, now, when I look at forgiveness, anything that the devil tried to hold me with, I send, I send it off. Yeah. I send it off. I, I, away, I, I send it away. Yeah. In the name of Jesus, saying you have no authority here. Yeah. I command that you loose yeah. whatever the situation might be now. Whatever the situation might be. I've had certain situations Amen. in my life that the enemy tried to hold me slave to. Yeah. He, he, he tried to hold me slave to, 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 to eating. Yeah. Can I get a witness? Yeah. Can I get a witness? Amen. Now, see, let me tell you something now. Once a slave is a slave. Yeah. Now, again, that man got to be set free. Because yeah. he'll still be acting like a slave. Yeah. Oh, glory to God. He'll still... You want to be set free from sin. And the only way you set free from sin, you got to quit committing that sin. It might be drinking. It might be drugs. It might be fornication. It might be adultery. Oh, glory to God. You got to what? Break free. Break free. Break the chain that's binding you up. Now, now, now those who build this cathedral, Wanted to express how Jesus' death on the cross provided freedom from sin. They, you, you, they, they want to 
want you to, to look at, 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 at the marvelous building. And then they want you to come in. And then they want you to hear about this Jesus. They want you to hear about what he did on Calvary. And once you heard what he did on Calvary, it, you got a right to be free. I see everybody that come to everybody that come into the church, they don't come in free. But they got once they get in the church, they need to hear a word to let them know they can be free. Oh glory to God. Now see, the enemy is gonna constantly try to pull you back where you come from. Oh glory to God. Don't you know that uh slavery in this country, slavery in this country has been over for nearly a hundred and fifty years. But yet there are still people that got a, a, a slave mentality to the point of not knowing who they are. You see, if, you, if they knew if they knew there was a child of a king, they know they ain't, they ain't no slave. If they knew they were heir to the throne, they would know that they ain't in poverty. If they knew that, they, hey, I'm healed by his stripes, they know that they, 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 ain't, they ain't bound to sickness. Can I get up? You see, the enemy is going to try to attack the body. The enemy is going to try to hold that flesh yeah. chain. But I'm here to tell you, Jesus Christ breaking every chain. I don't care what the situation is. Amen. I don't care what the problem might be. Yeah. The problem might be with your husband. Yeah. The problem might be with your children. Yeah. The problem might be with your neighbor. Yeah. The problem might be with your, with your, with your co-worker. Yeah. But whatever the chain is, God can break the ch chains that's bound in you. Amen. Can I get a witness? Now you, you say, well, wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait, wait a minute, Pastor. You, 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 you said it. He, he might have you bound to your children. Let me tell you something. The enemy used any avenue he can. See, see, the Bible says, the thief cometh to rob, to kill, and to destroy. Now, if your child, your husband, your brother, your sister, your neighbor, your if they ain't saved, guess what? That's the avenue the enemy going to use. He's going to use, guess what? Oh, honey, to get to you. But any time the enemy try to use any avenue to come toward me, I'm going to say, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, glory to God. You got to know that there's power in the name because that man, Jesus Christ, the only begotten son, he died on Calvary that we may have grace with God. And by having grace, we have forgiveness. And by having forgiveness, anything that the day, we don't long to him no more. I never long to God. I've been born again. I'm a new creature. The, chain, the chains can't, you can't hold me back with no chains. Well, well, well I'm not doing anything. I'm just, I'm just trying to live my life and, and, and don't bother nobody. That might be your problem. I, 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 hey, I'm not, I'm not trying to live my life no bother nobody. I want to make sure, hey, I'm a, I'm a nuisance to the devil. Can I get a witness? I ain't going to agree on nothing that ain't right. Just to live it. Uh-uh. Oh, well, oh, they don't want to hear that. Listen, I'm sorry. I don't, if making you mad by me talking about Jesus, you better get ready. You better get ready to make you mad. I see, now, the one thing I don't go along with now, I don't go along with you, man. You going to hell. I ain't sending nobody to hell. But I'm, but I'm, I'm not going to agree with, with things that you're doing wrong. I'm gonna say, the Word says, and when I tell you what the Word said, I'm telling you what Jesus wants you to apply in your life. And when you apply that in your life, you're going to acquire the things of God. No, 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 no. Listen, listen, listen here, listen here now. The forgiveness. See, the, in the scriptures, it means that separating the sin from your sin. Separ I said separating sin from your sin. Sin will always be here, but that don't have to be your sin. Oh, guess what? You can separate yourself. Do you do you think uh folk getting drunk gonna go away? But you can separate yourself, because guess what? You ain't got to be getting drunk. Uh, do, 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 you, do, do you think ain't no, nobody gonna stop? Everybody gonna stop doing drugs? No, but I can't make that sin my sin. Cause I got to what separate? He said, "Come from amongst them, be ye separate," says the Lord. I, I can't get involved in it. Oh, glory to God! Fornication. 
adultery. You got to understand that God is going to bring you out because he's delivering you individually now. God ain't delivering the, the, the mama, the, the son, and the grandson. No, 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 no. God going to deliver you by yourself, and then you got to get them to have an individual relationship with God for themselves. That's how it works. That's how, that's how I got to work. But you want to try to talk them into it. You want to try to get them to see. Now listen, as they built, as they built the cathedral, they expressed the, 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 the death of Christ. They expressed how you could be saved. The apostle Paul spoke on in his letter to the Ephesians. He spoke in his letter. He talked to him about what you can have through Christ. He, 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 he started he start off the by by talking about the redemption. Redemption means to what? Bring back. Bring back that which is separated from him. You see, you can also separate yourself from God. Bring it, bring it back. Bring them back to me. Bring them back to, to the king. Bring them back to God. Redemption points in the Old Testament noted that the marketplace with someone Buying back a person. You see, Christ, God bought, bought us back. He bought us back with the blood of Christ. We were lost. The only way, man, the only way he got man back, he bought all of the slaves. He bought all of them that was in sin. He bought them back through Christ. But just because, just because you, you, you go tell a slave, you're free. And you take the chains off of him. I can tell you that that mind ain't been changed. That slave ain't going nowhere. Amen. What you mean I'm free? Amen. Uh, 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 well, I, 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 I ain't got the chains on, but what's wrong with that, that person? He don't know he's free. He going to stay right there. And that's what a lot of people do in sin. They don't know they've been free from sin. But we got to know that the chains are broken. The chains are broken. They are broken. And they are broken by the blood of Jesus Christ. They are broken by the blood of Jesus Christ. See, God's accomplishments and forgiveness by transferring us from sin into his grace. It's a transformation. It's a transformation from sin into grace. And that's what we got to understand. God is there that we may be able to receive what? It's grace. He, he break the chain. He break the chain. I don't know what chain you're dealing with today. I don't know. I don't know what chain's got you, but I'm here to tell you. Whatever it is, God can break it. You see, everybody ain't dealing with the same thing. See, some people want to talk about hey, that ain't me, child. Now, well, it may not be, but you you dealing with something that you need God to chain. God need to break. But I'm here to tell you, Jesus is about breaking all chain. I'm not. I know I love the Lord. I'm filled with the Holy Ghost. What about oh, glory? I, 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 I am a child of the King. But I know one thing, there are still some chains that the devil tried to chain you back up with. But when he come right with them chains, I don't let him now. Can I get a witness? See, he's very subtle. He'll, he'll get close enough to you, talk to you, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he'll, he'll, he'll have you to, to c commit sin again. And before you know it, you done, you done, you're back, you done got chained back. You, you notice when someone trying to, that, that, that be free from, from alcoholism. They can go, they can go for months and months and months. But if they ever go back and take those drugs, the, 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 the flush, the flush is just, just get, oh wow, want some more, want some more. What what you done did, you done allowed the enemy to what? Put the chain back on you. Can I get a witness? A alcoholic. He he can go for months, months. And some people don't done went done went for years. And, and and they took one 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 drink. Glory to God. One drink. And that hey, and for they, they right back what they they allowed the chain to be put back on. Once you've been once you've been delivered, don't go back where you come from. See too many folk do that. They they they, they go to church and everything, they, yeah, 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 you know. They might have they might have been in some. It might might might, might have been some 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 out relationship. Might have been fornication. Might have been adultery. Well, I'm free. And guess what? Just go back. And before you know it, 
you chained them and chain you back up again. Can I get it? I said, break them chains. Break the chain of sin. I, I'm not going to allow sin to become my sin because I want to be separated from what? My sin. Glory to God. I, I can't get rid of sin. You always have sin. But you got to, you, but you can, through Jesus Christ, stop yourself from being chained back up again. Glory to God. Some people are lying. Some people can't help it. Now you better, I, you know, when they come to a liar, they say, you know, he was doing good. And I, I thought he had done quitting lying. Don't take but one. Because we got to understand one thing now. When you tell one lie, you got to tell another lie to back that lie up. Because a lie will not stand. Lie can't stand. If you tell one lie, you got to tell another lie to back that lie up. Well, then you say, yeah, yeah, I said that, but you know, uh, yeah, 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 you know, but I, I, I left this. A lie ain't going to stand. Can I get a witness? I don't know what chain you got, but I'm here to tell you, it can be broken. Chains, chains can be broken. Now, 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 now look here now. Paul's opening words in this letter is, is bubbling. He, 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 he is bubbling. He's just over bubbling with, 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 with joy. He, he, he's over bubbling with the thought of, of, of his, his freedom in Christ. I said his freedom in Christ. Now, 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 see, Paul was never a, a slave in 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 the, in the society, but he was. He, but he knew that he was a he was slave because his mind had been set free. But but when he got set free, when he when he received, when he accepted his grace by what Christ had did on the cross, then Paul that he, he was just happy. <laughs> oh, glory to God! Devil, you can't you can't hold me no more. I got freedom. You see, and you, see, the joy of the Lord is your strength. When the enemy starts trying to tear you down and bring you back, you got to start shouting. You got to start praising God. You got to let go. Oh, Lord, I thank you for bringing me out, Lord. Lord, I don't want to go back, Lord. Lord, I don't want to be a backslider, Lord. I want to press toward that more. I want to press forward, Lord. I want to forget those things which are behind me. But I want to press forward, Lord. Don't, 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 don't let the devil, don't let the devil chain you up again. You see, you got to understand now, breaking the chains don't mean that, hey, the enemy can't put the chains back on you. Now, now, now when, you, when you break the chains, now, it don't mean now that you going to hell. See, your, your soul got, got, got separated. But what you do, you put the flesh back in, in slavery. You, you, you put the flesh back in separation. You see, the flesh has a yearning for things. The flesh, the flesh has a yearning for things. The, 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 the desire of the eye. Oh, glory to God. You, you, you might have had a, a problem with, 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 with sex. You, you, the, 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 the eye, the eye. The eye take you back. But guess what? You got to pray, Lord, purge me of anything that's not of you. They were trying to get you to put the chain back on. He, 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 you know, he ain't going to tell you. I'm going to make you a slave. He ain't going to tell you you're going to make you a slave again. I know the devil, the devil to do, he'll try to make you a slave now. He'll be subtle. Talking like, you know, you, you, you can go on over there. Ain't nobody going to know. You just, just going to, you know, they want to go over there. Just, just one time, ain't nobody, you know. Ain't nobody going to do. But guess what? As soon as you dip back in the sand, he done put a chain on you. Oh, wow. Then you're going to start worrying about, did anybody see me? And let me tell you something. When you, when you start dabbling back in sin, you dab back in sin with other sinners. Can I get a witness? Now, they, they will lie on you. They will double-cross you. Now, I ain't going to tell it. I ain't going to tell on you. And the next thing you know, everybody in town know it. Can I get a witness? Glory to God. But, but wait, no, no, man, he doing, man, that, that joke ain't doing, that joke is the same. He ain't doing, he ain't, he ain't, you know, he ain't doing, no, he ain't doing the same. You know, I, I you know, I, I had a person that, 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 that uh, talking like that, but, you know, I'm saying that, but guess what? If they didn't go devil back, you wouldn't have any time. Can I get a witness? The enemy going to use somebody to tear you down. But, glory to God. 
I thank God that when somebody gonna say something about me, they gonna say what he used to be. Hey, then I can say, hey, that old man dead. You know, I seen him last night. Like, I, hey, that man, that, but hey, but hey, hey, that man got up and walked again. Can I get a witness? If he got up and walked again, he was alive. No, no, no. Well, he, yeah, I, he, yeah, he got up late at night, but, but I, I don't put him back to death. You can talk like that if you want to. No, no. If he got up late at night, guess what? He might be up, he might be up two, three more nights past this. Because you, you, you got to crucify him. You got to, put, oh, glory to God. When you bear, when you bury that nature, you got to let that nature stay buried. Because once that nature get up, Oh, the chain back on. You got to break the chain. And when you break the chains, bury that nature. Bury that nature. I, 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 the Lord doesn't deliver me from so many things. But I thank him and guess what? And when they try to come back, I tell him, Satan, you're a lie. You don't live here no more. This is not your residence. You you can't come back here. And oh, hey, he going to tempt you now. He going to tempt you. He gonna make you think about the the, the old time. That's what I said. And then I lose my mind, lose my mind, I lose my mind. Because guess what? It, you know, son, you got some. Uh, you can look at some. Uh, I've looked at some of those movies, and they they talk show shows you know uh, slavery, and they having to come out and be singing. And they just like they were so happy. Can I get with me? Like they were so happy. But once they were set free. Then some of them end up going, I sure wish I was in slavery again where I could go and, 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 just, and, just, and just sing and dance for the master. Yeah. Yeah, you, you might have something like that, but guess what? If they like that, hey, they might have never been changed. They might have never. You want to go back and, and sing and, and sing and dance for the master? Can I, and all the master I want to sing and dance for is Jesus Christ. Can I get a witness? And guess what? He ain't going to have me that singing it and looking at sin. And I'm going to look at sin and say, oh, whoa. The devil really had me fooled right there. That, that wasn't no fun there. You going to, hey, he going to sing and dance and they shout, oh, yeah. And tomorrow you're going to back in the, back in the cotton field in the hot sun. Yeah, I bet you wasn't singing and that, dancing out that there. Can I get a witness? So we got to understand that enemy want to bring you back. And he ain't bringing you back with no good. He's bringing you back to steal from you, steal your freedom. He's bringing you back to steal your joy. He's bringing you back to steal your peace. Can I get a witness? I said, break the chain, break the chains. The chain need to be broken. You see, again, we need to we need to point out that that must be layers and layers of praise. Layers and layers of praise. You got to talk about your, your praise. You got to talk about your freedom. Oh, you got to let somebody know. That's called testifying. You got to let somebody know. I once was lost, but now I'm found. I once was blind, but now, ooh, glory to God, now I see. You got to tell somebody. And how you, how you, how you once was lost, I was lost because I didn't know Jesus. But, but now I'm found because I know him. I, I was you blind? I once was blind because I couldn't see him. But now I can see I can see the light. I can see the light. And as I see the light, I say, it's breaking my chain. It's breaking my chain. You got to testify. You got to praise. You got to put levels of praise on levels of praise. You got to, if you don't talk about him, you're going to talk about something. When somebody comes talk to me about my old, my old sinful nature, I got to tell them about Jesus. I got to tell them I'm no longer bound, but now I'm free. I'm no longer blind, but now I see. I'm no, I'm no longer, my chains have been broken. I am free. I'm no longer a slave. I said, I'm free. Can I get a witness? Can I get a witness now? I said, break the chain, break the chain. The chain is holding you back. The chain is holding you down. Whatever it might be. I don't know your problem. I don't know what you're going through. But I thought you'd like to know. God is there for you. All he needs you to do is just say, Break the chain. Deliver me, Lord. Deliver me and bring me on into your into your kingdom. Break the chain. Break the chain. Break the chain. The chain ready to be broken. But we got to ask God to break them. And when God brings us out, we got to stay out. Don't go back in now. Don't let the devil drag you back in. 
He there now. He, he wants to pull you back in. Break the chain. Break the chain. Oh, glory. I hope y'all got some out of this.